Hi, what can I get started for you tonight? Oh, hi. Hi, I, I didn't see you walk in. Hi. Sorry, is that the third time I've said hi? <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, I work here. Hence the uniform. You think I'd wear this voluntarily? <laughs> I'm doing okay. You know, just working a lot. No, actually, I'm still a lifeguard, yeah. I just don't get as many hours now that summer is over, and I needed more money for school and some family stuff, so I got two jobs. It's not so bad. I mean, it's usually pretty quiet here. Yeah, like now, for instance. <laughs> How does it feel to be our only customer? <laughs> You are special. So, um, speaking of, would you like to try today's special? Our Greek omelette. With a side of home fries, toast, and coffee. I know it's a breakfast food, but we tend to draw in an older crowd, and usually in the mornings, so usually our specials are breakfast. Sorry. <laughs> um, is that a yes anyway? Okay. One Greek omelet with a side of fries, toast, and coffee. Yeah, I know. I remember how you like your coffee. And what was that? A chocolate shake? So what? Go with your coffee? Hey, no judgment. I I love chocolate shakes, you know that, but I'm a little thrown off, but sure. Okay. One chocolate shake. Anything else? Okay. I will be back in a little bit with your food. Okay. See you in a sec. Here you are. You're very welcome. Let me know if I can get you anything else. Hmm? Yeah? Uh, what, like right now? You want me to sit with you right now? No, I, I do want to. I'm, it's just I'm working. Right, but usually when there are no customers, I go to the back and organize the stock shelves. <laughs> I, I don't want to make Caesar mad. Caesar, my boss. Wait, the, the chocolate shake. You're kidding, right? You got it for me? <laughs> you are... You are really something. Okay, fine. Sure, I'll sit. Well, you bring up an excellent point. The customer is always right. <laughs> so, what is this? You showing up here, buying me a milkshake, asking me to sit with you. D did you know that I work here? Is that why you came? Oh, okay, so this is just a coincidence then. That's, that's embarrassing. How presumptuous can I be? Fate, you're calling it fate. <laughs> Interesting. And no, I just, I, I didn't know you believed in fate. Um... I don't know if I do. I guess I'm on the fence about it. But maybe I could be convinced. Well, um, I guess my whole issue with the idea of fate is that... I don't know, I guess it feels lazy. Like it seems like an excuse. 
an excuse for not putting in work. I think the whole idea of waiting for fate to step in is a bad message. If you want something to happen, you should just make it happen, you know? You can't just wait around, never putting any effort in because you think fate will hand you success on a silver platter. But I guess I can see how some things are just out of your control. And I do like to believe that some things fall into place at the right time. <laughs> How's the food? <laughs> Thank you, but I, I didn't make it. Caesar did. No, I didn't make them. I swear. Oh, what was I doing in the back then? Um, I was organizing the stock shelves. <laughs> okay, and I was trying to remember how to breathe. <laughs> you caught me off guard showing up here. I needed a moment to calm myself down. You don't have to be sorry. I mean, you didn't even know I'd be here. You just wanted some food. It's not your fault you walked into the wrong diner. No, I'm sorry. I think I'm giving you the wrong impression. It's not that I'm not happy to see you. I am. I'm glad you walked in. Yeah. Did it catch me by surprise? Yes. Am I still freaking out a little? Yes. But am I happy to see you? Always. I don't hate you. I know that after we broke up and we said we'd stay friends, I sort of let us lose touch, but it's just because I still it was just hard to, um, hold on, Caesar is scowling at me behind the counter. Um, I got here late this morning, so I'm sort of already on the ice. I'm so sorry, um, but I should, I should really get back to work. I'm sorry, um, but here. This is my new phone number. Give me a call and maybe we can catch up at a better time. Okay. I'll see you. Hey, wait. Wait. You walk really fast. <laughs> I can't take this money. This tip is like ten times the amount of the food itself. I can't accept this. I'm serious. It's too much. Please take it. I don't want your money. I mean that in the most respectful way possible. Look, I wouldn't be able to live with myself if I took this. You're really not going to let me give it back, are you? So stubborn. Why are you doing this? Okay, but no one deserves that much of a tip. You don't owe me anything, you know. The way things ended between us, it was mutual, okay? No hard feelings. What I was saying earlier about how I distanced myself from you, it's not because I hated you or anything. I just couldn't go on pretending 
that I didn't still have feelings for you. I can't go on pretending. A little heavy on the PDA there. I, um, I told Caesar that I was going to take my 15 minute break, so if you want to find somewhere to sit, I have 15 minutes. <laughs> you have no idea how much I missed you. 